If a game like the Call of Duty Vanguard cannot connect to its servers, you probably won't be able to enjoy it as it relies heavily on the uptime of its servers. It won't be able to load most of its services and features, so you really need to fix it before you can enjoy it. Welcome to our channel, and in this video, we will show you how to fix Vanguard that can't connect to online services on Xbox Series X or S. What you have to do first is to check if it's a server issue or anything else. Server-related problems are often reported and posted on the Xbox Live status page, so that's what you have to visit first. Just launch a web browser on your console, and then log on to support.xbox.com. Once the page loads, click Xbox status. Now scroll down and check every service on the page to see if some are having some issues. You may also visit support.activision.com and check the server status. If it happens to be a server issue, then you just have to wait as the problem will be fixed in an hour or two. However, if everything looks good, then try to see if you have a fast and stable internet connection. Games like Vanguard need a stable connection all the time for everything. So if your connection is slow, it might not be able to connect to online services. All you have to do is launch the settings app on your Xbox. Select General and then select Network Settings. Select Test Network Connection, and if the connection test is successful, your console will connect to the Xbox service. Then select Test Network Speed and Statistics to do a speed test, and then wait until it's finished. If it's indeed due to a slow connection, then restart your Xbox and your router at the same time. After that, try to see if the game works perfectly after that. Should the problem continue, the next thing you have to do is to clear the game save data on your console. There's a possibility that some of those files are outdated or corrupted. Once deleted, your console will create a new set of cache once you run the game again. To do so, press the Xbox button on your controller to pull up the side menu. Highlight my games and apps and then press A. Select See All to view all your games and apps. Highlight Vanguard and then press the menu button on the controller. Highlight Manage Game and Add-ons and press A. Now select Save Data and then select Delete All to remove the cache of the game. Once the cache is deleted, run the game again to see if the problem still occurs. If it does, then you have no other choice but to reinstall the game itself. As long as it's not an issue with your connection or the servers, you should be able to fix the problem by doing this procedure. Here's how. Press the Xbox button on your controller. Highlight my games and apps and then press A. Select See All to view your games and apps. Now highlight Vanguard and then press the menu button on the controller. Highlight Uninstall and press A. Highlight Uninstall All and press A to proceed. Reboot your console and then reinstall Vanguard. Once installed successfully, run the game and it should work properly. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. If you find this video helpful, we'd love it if you tap the thumbs up button below and subscribe to our channel. We will be publishing more helpful videos every day, so stay tuned.